are waiting here, mm -hmm. so you can eat the best test in Mado. But you can eat everything. At this current moment, I'm putting myself back on the market and dating. <laughs> back to my channel if you're new here my name is Sujin Yanga and I consider myself to be a very vibrant person and a vibrant spirit on my channel you'll find videos all related to self-love feminine and mental wellness and some videos will be videos like this where I'm just taking you along my journey and showing you how I live life vibrantly yeah as you can see I have on some colors my hair is well done my makeup's looking beautiful and I'm in the jungle <laughs> just wanted to make it look very aesthetic and really nice but I'm currently ready and going to head out and go to The Hague so that I can meet my cousin and we're now going to then take some pictures first actually have a little brunch chit chat sit down time and then go and take some pictures because I want to pimp up and get all of my personal branding wait my hands a bit like tired <laughs> all my personal branding stuff all like uh, looking the same and just really nice throughout all my platforms and everything else so yeah that's why I'm looking all so beautiful and really colorful funny story is I was looking for jobs and I found oh I got reacquainted with this company it's called Lovies I don't know if it's Lovies or Lovies it's a Dutch company I believe here in the Netherlands and they sell really beautiful fashion pieces and I got this one because I just thought yes that is exactly um, what my brand and what I stand for so this is it um, yeah I didn't apply for that job however or not yet however it's on my radar and I'm going to apply for it I believe today tomorrow it's just a lot going on but I thought I'd tell you the little backstory of how I found this so I found that job went to the site and then found this and was like uh. This is totally me and I now want to like do a whole rebranding where I wear this and this become like the face of Sajin. That was just like a little quick what's going on where I am now. Um, the last few days have been a bit nice. Went back into the office for a bit. Uh, that was good. Had some feedback. Everything's going well with the current job. Um, and yeah, there was just some extra stuff that wants to go on to change my energy today but no girl we're going we're gonna have a good time make beautiful pictures and let's go <laughs> Now you don't know what to say. No, it's only joke, but what I can say 
Here is the best place. Yeah. Everybody, we are waiting here. Mm -hmm. So you can eat the best test in Mado. What you can eat? Everything. <laughs> Perfect. And you're the, the coolest waiter. Uh -huh. You're the coolest waiter, right? And the, oh, on the birds, not on <laughs> here. I'm the best one in the world. I will. I'll send it to you. Like my name too. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> For good service and men that make you laugh. Thank you. The best baklava in Holland. Perfect. Why? Because I'm doing everything. my walk I think you most probably saw it's a street here right I'm seeing I'm just back home from my walk it was really windy outside and a bit cold so I'm happy I wore my like more winter jacket to keep me warm but on my walk I was listening to a podcast that I recently discovered I'm going to share it with you because Maybe it might be something you also want to listen to. Or I'm really enjoying it, I should say, because it's by black girls. Blah, 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 blah. By black girls. And the ones that they're talking about now is all about dating and uh, yeah, everything to do with dating. So that's something that's interesting me because at this current moment, I'm putting myself back on the market and dating, yeah. Yeah, I think in a video I'll probably also share my experiences so far, but uh, we're not really experiences, I had one. <laughs> I had one, I could have had a bit more, but mm -mm, I'm just really known or I'm just really... I'm aware, yeah that's it, I'm aware of what I want and how I want to feel and... That's actually one thing that they shared in one of the podcasts, the one I listened to before listening to the other one. It's so good that I listened to one full episode and I'm now listening to a second one already. Um, and I'll probably listen to it while I make my breakfast. The one I listened to before was on draft. So the title is called Draft Season Part 2, Manifesting the Perfect Love with Aaliyah Lovely. I listened to her podcasts, I should say, and they're really good. Um, this is it. I don't know if you can see with the camera, but that's it. And I'll show you also their graphic, which is really nice. It's pretty. And yeah, I love that it's by black girls. So they also are going through the same things that, you know, we're going through or I'm going through. And they can relate to what's happening. So that is what I appreciate very much. Um, yeah, I thought I'd share that. Didn't really end yesterday's vlog or show or share or show more from the rest of the day. But I wanted to come on and say that things didn't go well. The energy was a bit off. So we decided to do part ways and not go through with um, filming. And that's because of some events and stuff. And that's okay. That's all fine. 
I'm now realizing and becoming much more aware again, uh, very aware lately and sometimes, I don't know if it's a good thing, but I think it is a good thing overall. Uh, yeah, I actually filmed a, a sit down video last night and just talk and just was talking about things that was going through my head and I think that video will be up after this video so if you want to see exactly what I was thinking and talking about out loud stay tuned for that it's quite interesting and yeah so that day didn't go so well my brand photo shoot and stuff didn't come out or happen <laughs> which is fine it's all okay now and it's better I think to be honest with yourself about how your energy is feeling and if things feel right because if it isn't then trying to make it feel right when it isn't isn't going to give you the end result you're looking for so yeah and I also wanted to share actually um, I made a tweet about it so if you are on Twitter follow me I don't tweet every day but when things happen and, and I feel a way I make my way there and I dump everything them but um yeah I tweeted about it and what it was was when I was leaving Den Haag yesterday to go get the tram to come back home I was really much in my head and just thinking about the energy and everything that just happened uh, yesterday while the photo shoot did not go through and I was being really hard on myself and thinking quite poorly while I was doing that I was walking in like a crowded section and this one girl just came running up to me and she was like hey you have echt a toffe outfit aan ik vind je outfit super mooi and she I was walking this way and she ran up and like ran to my left side and it was just so it was just so out of the blue and it literally made me get very emotional and almost cry like oh <laughs> people don't realize how kind it is to be just nice and share a comment or compliment with someone um, that uplifts of course the other person it really it really does something and I don't think that girl probably watches my videos or anything but if she would ever see this or if you ever see this and you give someone a compliment you don't know exactly how much of an impact that had in that person okay yeah when she said it i almost wanted to cry because i felt so emotional i was like oh you're so kind you don't know like i also struggle actually i also was struggling because i you saw what i had on and for me it's beautiful it's perfect it's amazing like in my sacred space and in my area i feel that that's a beautiful outfit but when i went out i just felt like maybe i'm too bright maybe this is too much maybe people think i'm a clown for having on so many colors yeah that's how i felt and then after everything that happened it was like oh what is wrong with you but yeah I thought I would share that because I am a firm believer in being transparent and also being very um, open about things that happen. I love watching videos and vlogs where people go and do stuff and have fun and I am a person I love to have fun, go do stuff, but I want to bring that transparency to my channel and not be that everything is all perfect and stuff because everything is not and I know how it is to think everything is perfect and then want it that way as well so yeah I just want to be a person that brings transparency to my YouTube channel and to my social media platforms that when things happen I talk about them and I can build off of them because yeah it's what builds the human connection and also can help someone else that is struggling with self-love or thinking they're beautiful um, by knowing that the questions that you have in your head are valid and are also okay. Being vulnerable is not a bad thing to be. Um, and I think, yeah, of course, you have to not be vulnerable with everyone because not everyone can appreciate and help you get out of that or see things in a way that is a bit more uh, bright, I guess. So yeah, on my channel, I'm claiming it and I'm making it 
official that this is a safe space and that I am able to share my authentic self with my viewers and my viewers are also able and allowed to share their authentic, authentic, <laughs> authentic selves with me. So yeah, I'm going to now make breakfast. Breakfast is served. I made some bread with pesto, spread and then avocado, egg and tomatoes. And I just took one bread and cut that in half and I'm going to have it like two separate breads. <laughs> and it's on an Italian bun, which is really nice because it has herbs and flavor. And then I'm going to have some apple drizzled with lemon and tea. And the tea that I have is sponsored by, <laughs> by Mado. They actually, the server actually gave me one to take home and I took the chamomile lemongrass so I'm really excited to have try this one now and if it is nice I'll probably go back and have tea by them again and in that tea I'm going to put some honey and I also have some juice so I have a full breakfast here today I'm going to go and sit down and just chill relax have some me time and then get to doing what I need to do so yeah I'll see you in a few carry on and to build